Hello, thanks for joining me for today's reading. Just remember, this is a collective reading, so take what resonates and leave the rest. Today, today's is going to be a love reading, but the first message I, I pulled was from the Guardian Angels deck, as always, to get a little theme. And they want you to believe. Be open to all possibilities and opportunities. Let go of preconceived ideas. There is nothing to fear. You are constantly surrounded by love. Start to believe in yourself and trust your instincts. Wondrous possibilities and opportunities abound. Provided you are flexible and retain an open heart and mind, believe all is possible. So they want you to believe in yourself and believe that great love does exist if that's truly what you're looking for. It's out there, it's coming, and they want you to believe in yourself. Because the first card that I pulled was that a committed romantic relationship is on its way into your life. You are gonna be swept off your feet. You're gonna be very happy. You're gonna feel those butterflies and that heart fluttering. Um, something we don't all always feel, but you are gonna be happy about this situation. The only thing is, oh yeah, and this could be male or female, um, the only thing is that most of you seem like you are currently in a connection that is not working. So that is going to cause some stress for you. Um, you're going to be overanalyzing, you're going to be stressing, you're not going to be sure what to do. But this new relationship seems much better and healthier. But you get to decide what you want to do in the situation. It's definitely going to be... Oh yeah, I didn't, I didn't show you the cards. You see, that's some conflicts with the current person. Um, so you are definitely going to be celebrating. This is the 11-11 card. A lot of times it shows like like a marriage, a happy marriage, if that's what you want, or just a happy relationship. You can see a couple there, they're being watched over, guided, protected. Um, it seems like a very happy time of celebration if you choose this new person. And uh, the guides or angels, God, whatever you believe in, they just want you to remember that everything happens for a reason. They don't want you to be upset with yourself or have regrets. Just know that now is an opportunity to have happiness and just to search for the silver lining in this situation because I do believe that everything happens for a reason and there's almost always something positive that comes out of negative situations. We may not see it at the time, but I do believe that everyone comes into our life for a reason, a season, or a lifetime. So not every relationship is meant to last forever. And I'm talking about the current one that you may be in. Sometimes they're just here to teach you lessons, to help you grow, to get you to the next level in your life. So, you know, don't be too hard on yourself or upset with yourself if you choose to leave and move on to something better. And the last thing was that you may meet this person either through your career or you may actually eventually end up working with them in the future. So that's that one. And just for the fun of it, I'm gonna pull one more. I don't know where I put my deck. It was like hiding over there. <laughs> one more card just to see if there's anything else you need to know. So an excellent opportunity is about to be offered to you. And definitely it's also still intertwined with work. So again, it goes along with the opportunity is love coming in. And it's got something to do with your career. So uh, if you would like more of a personal reading specifically tailored for you, please check the description box below and book a personal session with me. And also, I'm gonna start doing live readings where they will be donation-based. You can ask me a question for a donation, but please comment below or hit the like button and let me know if you're interested in that. 
and thank you and have a great day.